just another quick video. I'm just going to talk about the app that I use for uh, my book collection. So I have Android, and this is really difficult to do through a screen. But it's right here, it's called Books App, and it's really easy to use. You can sort by book, series, author, publisher, and have a look at what your friends have, and there's two different ways to add books. The first way is to scan barcode. It comes up like that, and you just hover it over a barcode and it'll pick it up and read it. If uh, for some reason Google doesn't have that specific ISBN saved, there is another way to add as well. You go back out, and you go to search, and you can put in a book. So. For example, Dark Creed, it's one that I bought off eBay a couple of days ago, it's a Warhammer book. And what it does first is it searches your collection first, so that's my collection. And then you can hit the Google and it comes up with all the different uh, books by, with that name or author. And you can just hit it and then you hit Menu and you can't really see it very well but it says for me it says edit book but it will come up with save book and if you hit that it saves it into your collection it's really handy um, I think I got the free version and I have a collection of 303 books at the moment I have another two to add in later but it's really handy for when I go to book sales and thinking oh fuck do I have this book? I don't know so just to sort by author, and it comes up and it tells you how many, these little blue things on the side just tell you how many books you have by that author. And it's by alphabetical, um, it's alphabetical order by last name. Um, it's a little, it, it usually skips middle names, which is good. Um, and your books, I'm just going to switch hands. Now it does sort by A, and I believe it sorts by the as well. Yeah, so usually, like when I'm cataloging myself, I ignore things like A and the and an unless it's um, necessary for the title. But this app does sort by those words. But it's pretty nifty. And down the bottom, you can list your favourites reading now to read and have read. And if I remember correctly, you can actually mark a book as lent out. Uh, yep, there's a little option here that says lend book. And then you can pick a friend. And it takes you to your uh, list of people. I have a lot of people on there that I don't actually have numbers and stuff for, but it's going off my Facebook friends, so... Yeah, it's, um, I'll put a link to it. Um, I don't know whether it's available for, um, for, uh, iPhone, yeah, iPhone. Uh, I do know it's for Android, and there'll be a link to that, and I'll have a look and see if it's for iPhone as well. But while I've got this video going, I bought new bookshelves the other day. So I'm going to show those off because now they're all tidy and neat and pretty awesome. So this is the original bookshelf. I have just some of my random books and Virginia Andrews up there, as well as any library books that I have, ex-library books. Uh, down here there's Melissa Ma, Erica Hayes, Joe Hill, I've got my Stephen King there. Random books and more books. And my Wilbur Smith, and Mr. Men, because everybody loves Mr. Men. And this shelf I just kept in that kind of stacking so that I could double stack books because the bottom shelf was just full of crap and bags and files and that because it's harder for me to get to the bottom shelf because of my needs. But my new bookshelf, it's very pretty. My Jean All. Angie Said, Georgia R. Martin, one of my Anne Rice books, 
the rest of my Anne Rice books. Um, Sylvia Plath and Corey Taylor are that there too. And then I've got all of my Cheryl and Kenyon, more Cheryl and Kenyon, and my Warcraft books. Now Arthur's and Illidan have a home. And that's Festa Jester the third. And then I've got Gina Showalter. I need to get Insurgent and Allegiant in the hardcovers because I found the Divergent hardcover for five dollars. And Kerry Arthur. I've got my Hunger Games series there. And that is my bondage duck named Bear. And we've got Sandra Clare. I need to get the first two um, Beautiful Creatures books. Or is it the first and the third that I need? Either way. My signed copy of Aragon was there as well. And then down the bottom is the three Harry Potter books I have because I haven't got the rest yet. And some of my larger copies of books. So, yeah. Oh, and my um, signed Garth Nix book is there too because I met them and they're awesome and they signed things for me. And then of course we've got the books that I have on my to read pile from the library next to my bed. And I have new posters. There's Kerrigan from Starcraft and Bioshock Infinite and a Big Bang Theory poster. And they only cost me $2 each because yay things. <laughs>